It is also very important to notice that um, we can help you with the service and delivery that help IT bring value. So most of the time we tend, we might tend to see nowadays still that IT can be a very um, cost, uh, costful um, uh, item within a within company. But on the other side is something also that we need to change our minds and see that nowadays in our new world and modern world with, with uh, new and modern workplaces that IT can deliver this value. And that is exactly what Innova can help you with. Service delivery and support also service delivery based on service level agreements, meaning that we monitor on a service level agreement base uh, the time period to um, execute the changes that need to be placed in all the, uh, and also the implementations to make sure that you and we and I as um, a service delivery manager are always aligned in our journey to a new change and upgrades of your of your system and your business. Last but not least, also deploying efficiency. This is a very important part for us, which we can give you and help you with. As we go on with the um, help that we can give, I will tune on to Dane right now, who can give you more of the examples how we how we proceed in all these steps. Okay, thanks, Ryan. So let's discuss our service delivery implementation. So we utilize a four phase um, approach where we start by doing an assessment. So that would be phase one, where we get a proper understanding of your environment. We, you know, have a discussion with you. Get an understanding of the do's and don'ts, the no-go areas, and we develop a remediation strategy within this assessment phase. So once we complete this assessment phase, we then move on to the deployment phase where we, so this is where we now do a thorough assessment. So we'll be going a bit deeper into this assessment where we, we get a, a better understanding of what's happening and what is needed to be deployed. We set up your environment, whether it's your Azure infrastructure or your Office 365 infrastructure. We assist you in in setting up your Active Directory, your licenses, your you know various stuff within this phase. But then once we we have completed this area, we then move on to the adoption phase. This is where we now train your users in these technologies. We provide support in terms of understanding the functionalities of the tools and so forth. And then we go into the final phase where we offer support where you know just in case there's anything you need any form of troubleshooting we're here to support you so yeah this is the, the approach that we take assessment deployment adopt support thank you so much dane and you will be asking yourself valuable client okay so what's in it for me so just like we brought the forward it is to reduce your service management costs first of all because we all know that we are living in very, very much um, challenging times. And nowadays we need to check out how we're going to help you along with this transition, with those transitions, transitions that we are, that you are facing. Also another part which is very, very um, important is get if effective support. We tend to give you the support in a way that your incidents or your issues will be resolved smoothly and fast. Why is this important? Because we know that business continuity is very important for you. That's this key. is what we are focusing on. Isn't it right, Dean? Yes, it is. Very good. Take advantage of simplified solutions. Life is very, very difficult already. So why should we keep on, give, keep on keeping it difficult? Let's make things simple. Simple, but in a valuable way, simple, but in a way that it suits also your business, simple in a way that at the moment that you start doing your adoption, it will be adopted very much quicker and even in a smoother way than you have ever seen before. We walk our talk. What do we mean with this? We use our own products. Yes, we do. We do what we do. 
we say what we do, but also we love, we love and we do the processes and we implement the processes just as we have at our offices, making sure that you get that you are receiving the best. Last but not least, benefit from highly skilled and Microsoft certified personnel. As you can see, we have Dane in here right now. We have a lot of um, uh, colleagues also abroad in different territories, which will be a pro, which will be a benefit for you because we can cater you from different territories and also from different time zones with different languages, English, Spanish and Dutch. So you never you never have to think that we will leave you alone. Let me just focus real quick on some new services that we have going on right now. First of all, active security assessment. Second of all, threat security assessment. Dane will give you more info about this one. OK, all right. So. The Azure security assessment, right? The goal of the, ass the assessment is to identify vulnerabilities within your Azure environment. So this assessment will identify, you know, vulnerabilities, make recommendations. So what does it promise to do? It promises to assure business continuity. It promises to give you cost effective services and it provides you with a tool which is user friendly and very adaptable. So this is what the Azure Security Assessment will do. Uh, do you want to hear information about the costing and so forth, right? Yes, exactly. That's exactly what it is. We use it indeed to get better insights on your business. We use it indeed to give you more insight of your own business though, because most of the time indeed, Dane, we bump into clients who think they know already what all the threats are for them outside there. Yeah. And in most cases, we can see that it's not an, 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 an intent of anybody, but it is just carefulness that we need to uh, make them aware of, right? Mm -hmm. The next step that we have, or the new services that we have is also the um, cloud metrics and dashboard services. This is a service which you can use to bring, to, to, to bring metrics into your company. We know that data nowadays is very important. Basically, you are steering also based on your data that you have that you have in your company. Cleansing of this data, creating metrics, creating reports, helping you out with queries based on KPIs or even helping you out with the KPIs, KPIs based on best practices or KPIs based on your needs. All of them we can use and we can help you with. We also have cloud security assessment. Dane, this is yours. All right, so the cloud security assessment, right? It looks on various stuff. It the Azure Active Directory. It, so it provides Azure Active Directory identity protection. We look at your Exchange um, environment. We follow best, best practices. We make recommendation in terms of best practices. We uh, we offer endpoint management and so forth. Exactly, thank you so much, Dane. So in a nutshell, these are the new services that we are delivering nowadays. But besides that, we can help you also with consultancy, with licensing, just like we have introduced ourselves today. And be sure that if anything, if you need any help, we are there for you.